Ang araw mga maalamat, ngayon naman talakayin natin ang division of mixed numbers. Ngunit uh, sana bago niyo panoorin ang video ito ay napanood niyo yung video tungkol sa pagpapalit ng uh, ng forma ng mixed numbers sa improper fraction dahil kakailangan niyo dito sa sa ating paksa. Okay, so you should have already viewed as well yung video tungkol sa paghahanap ng GCF at yung pagsisimplify ng fractions kasi kakailanganin din natin dito sa uh, topic na ating tatalakay. So kung hindi nyo pa napanood yung mga yon, pwede nyo bisitahin gamit ang link na nasa description. Okay, so para mas maintindihan natin yung pamamaraan ng pag-divide ng mixed numbers, let's have some examples. So in dividing mixed numbers, we have to express the mixed numbers first as improper fraction. So, in this case, we have 2 3 fourths divided by 5 1 half. So, the first thing that you're gonna do as what we've said a while ago, we have to express those uh, mixed numbers as improper fraction. So, in doing so, 4 times 2, 8, plus 3, 11, over yung denominator pa rin niya, 4. Then next, divided by 2 times 5, 10 plus 1, 11 over 2. Okay. Then, kung maalala natin, in dividing fractions, okay, we have to get the reciprocal of the divisor. Okay, so let's copy first the dividend. So, 11 over 4. Then, get the reciprocal. So, 2, the denominator 2 will become the numerator. And, yung numerator na 11 magiging denominator. Then proceed sa multiplication. Okay, so we have 11 times 2, 22. Over 4 times 11, 44. Then after having the multiplication process, kailangan nyo munang tingnan kung pwede pang isimplify yung fraction. Gaya nito, 22 over 44. Meron pa ba silang GCF? Okay, kung meron pa, Isi-simplify pa natin yung sagot natin yan. Okay, so let's divide both numerator and denominator by their GCF. That is 22. Okay, so 22 divided by 22, that is 1 over 44 divided by 22, that is 2. So the final answer is 1 half. Let's consider 3 and 5 over 7 divided by 2 and 2 thirds. So the first thing that you're gonna do is to express the mixed numbers as improper fraction. So 7 times 3, 21. Plus 5, 26. Over 7. Then 3 times 2, 6. Plus 2, 8. Over 3. Then proceed to multiplication. So 26 times 8, that is... 208 over 7 times 3, that is 21. Okay. So, kung titingnan natin, wala ng GCF ang 208 at 21. So, that would be the final answer. But uh, if we can notice, the given are in mixed numbers form. So, we have to express this as a mixed number number okay so we have 208 divided by 21 that is so the final answer when 3 and 5 over 7 is divided by 2 and 2 thirds is 9 and 19 over 21 let's consider this last example 4 and 1 fourths divided by 2 and 3 fourths okay so we have to express the mixed numbers as improper fraction first so 4 times 4 16 plus 1, 17 over 4. 4 times 2, 8 plus 3, 11 over 4. Okay, next is to get the reciprocal of the divisor. So let's copy first this. So 17 over 4, then the reciprocal is 4 over 11. Then proceed to multi. Application. Okay. So
So applying the the cancellation method in the multiplication process. Okay, so we have so kung ano ang uh, consider itong 4 and 4, so ang GCF nila ay 4. So 4 divided by 4, 1. 4 divided by 4, 1. Okay, so kung wala wala nang uh, uh, numerator and denominator na may GCF, then proceed to the multiplication process. So 17 times 1, 17. Over 1 times 11, 11. Okay, at kung mapapansin natin, yung sagot natin ay nasa or yung given natin ay mixed number. So we have to express our answer in mixed number or as a mixed number. Okay, so 17 divided by 11, that is 1. The remainder is 6. And the div divisor natin or the denominator is still 11. Okay, so that is the result when you perform the operation between 4 and 1 fourths and 2 and 3 fourths. So I hope you follow the process on how to divide mixed numbers.